Okay, so now I got my loops pulled up and um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to attach my yarn to the top right hand corner to the first stitch actually and I got the right side of the work facing towards me. So I'm just going to attach the yarn and I like to tie double knots just because um, you can do this with a slip knot and it should work as well too. So I'm just going to chain three. Okay, and that's going to count as my first double crochet. Now I'm going to work another three double crochet into the same stitch. Okay, so we got a total of four stitches in the corner stitch. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to double crochet into the next four stitches. Okay, so now we are up to the Jacob's Ladder loop. And all I'm going to do is I'm just going to slip stitch into that loop. Just like that. And then I'm going to double crochet into the next five stitches. slip stitch into the Jacob's Ladder loop again. And double crochet into the next five stitches. But since we're at the corner, I'm going to work another three double crochet into the last stitch here. Okay, so that's your corner. And you're going to work another uh, 17 double crochet stitches evenly across the side here. Okay, so I got my 17 uh, single crochets along the side here. I mean double crochets. and So I'm going to work uh, four double crochets into the corner um, back loop right here. And then I'm going to double crochet into the next four stitches and I'm going to work into the back loops of the beginning chains. And then I'm going to front post triple crochet in front of into these loops of the first Jacob's ladder loop. So that'll be these two right here, and I'll just pull pull them together. So I'm just going to yarn over twice, and I'm going to insert the hook into the first loop and into the second, and I'm just going to pull through. And that just brings it together nice and tight. And then you double crochet into the next five stitches.
Okay, and then you want to uh, front post triple crochet once again around the next two loops. If you can find them. Okay, and then you double crochet into the next, to the last five back loops. So then you work another uh, three double crochet into the, this last corner stitch here. Okay, and then you work your 17 double crochet stitches along the side again, and then you can join it and fasten it off. Okay, so I have done my 17. Um, sing, uh, double crochets along the side and I'm just going to join my last stitch to the first double crochet that I made and then you just fasten off and that's it all you have to do is weave in your ends and you're all set to go.